Yeah, I mean, everyone wants to be the next Dark Souls, and I understand why. And what it is, but there, I think there's more to being a Dark Souls than just difficulty. It's about For sure. placement. It's about level design. Level design, a challenge without being stupid. Like It's actually like, hey, it's hard until you realize what to do right, and that there yeah. is an option. For me, like what drew me to Dark Souls originally wasn't necessarily the, the challenge, though that helped. It was the more like manual, heavy, sword-based combat. Yeah, and... Uh, like not being able to just spam a button and have attacks just, you know. Yeah, like I didn't actually get Dark Souls until Bloodborne, like the Dark Souls sister or whatever. But uh, what really like made me realize like, hey, this is a really cool design. It's like just how they built the levels. Mm -hmm. Like I wanted to draw maps. I wanted to go like, okay, where is everything like? Uh, uh, the use of like shortcuts of like warding like, hey, you got this far. There's a ladder. Like there's a really tough encounter this way uh, with a great reward, or you can just go this way. And everything felt like it made sense. It wasn't just like arbitrarily placed for no reason. Right. It wasn't like filler. Like it, it was challenging. It was a story. Right, it's everything. like almost every enemy placement is going to be its own, like, is going to be a substantial experience. Yeah. Like you saw it earlier with those two Millwood Knights, right? Yeah. Like, like that is one's the got the big axe, one's got the, you know, shooting giant arrows at you from behind. Yeah. 